My name is Dr. Mohan Keshava Murthy. Uh, I am Director of Urology, Urooncology, Robotic Surgery and Kidney Transplant at Fortis Hospitals, Bangalore. Uh, our flagship unit is at Banergata Road, Bangalore. Today I would like to discuss a new uh, technique for performing kidney transplant. Kidney transplant has been traditionally performed as open surgery. However, in the last decade, a robotic enabled kidney transplant has come into focus. Fortis Hospital's Banergata Road is one of the major centers performing robotic kidney transplant. What exactly is robotic kidney transplant? Instead of doing uh, a large cut to place the kidney which has been taken from a donor, we drop it through a small window and then use the robotic arms to do the anastomosis to the vessels in the recipient's body. In what way does it help? The magnification of the Da Vinci XI robot, which is the latest robot in the world and is the robot we use at Fortis Hospital's Banergata Road, helps you to do a fine anastomosis between the renal artery and vein of the donor kidney and the vessels of the recipient in a way where the possibility of failure is marginal or the possibility of a leak uh, post-surgery is, is, is prevented. This is because not just of the magnification but also the manual dexterity of the robot as well as the ability uh, to, to work with both the right and the left hands in a way where uh, normal human hand is unable to perform. We can also perform uh, transplants in those patients where the kidney has more than one artery or in those patients who receive a second, third or fourth transplant or in patients who, in whom the native kidney, the original kidney needs to be removed and the new kidney needs to be placed. In all these special situations, the robot comes as a boon for those patients who otherwise would have been at risk of failure following kidney transplant. When we perform robotic kidney transplant, we also do the donor nephrectomy using 3D laparoscopy, a combination of minimal invasive technique for both the donor and the recipient reduces the hospitalization time, time significantly. The donor goes home on the second post-operative day and the recipient usually goes home on the fifth post-operative day. A combination of lack of pain, uh, minimal scars, short stay in the hospital and an excellent outcome makes uh, the technique of robot enabled transplant a true uh, new avishkar, a new true invention in the old technique of uh, as compared to the old technique of open kidney transplant. Thank you.